And now, live from staging platform 5 of the Monolith Intersystems Tower at Lunar Station Tranquility, it's 24-7, Pan America's number one source for soft news in the basic cable spectrum, and winner of three Feely Awards for jaw-dropping achievement in transglobal misinformation. Here are Feely winning anchor models Cliff Face and Cookie Felcher. Good evening. Tonight on 24-7, we'll take you inside the mind of a serial monogamous. And then a bit later, we'll show you how to make a baby. But first, we're going to face investigates a curious case of... Murder. <laughs> Thanks, Cookie. Murder happens all the time. Every day. It's even happening right now. Maybe to someone you know. Maybe even to you. <laughs> what if it isn't? Or... What if it is? Would you recognize the warning signs of murder? <laughs> Randy and Jennifer Fisman were an ordinary couple. A couple just like you. Unless you're single. But one Wednesday, <laughs> last January, something happened that would change and end the lives of Randy and Jennifer Fisman forever. What happened that night in Thalidomide Falls, Idem, Ohio? <laughs> was it a simple disagreement? Or was it murder? <laughs> I asked a neighbor what it thought. You know what? They were nice people. They were normal people. People just like you. Well, or me. Except for that Randy, right? Ooh, yeah, he had a thirst for the blood. <laughs> what happened? What occurred? What took place? What turned a mild-mannered everyman into a Manson-esque maniac with a mood? A murder. <laughs> you may never know. So I asked another neighbor. Well, sometimes, sometimes he would take his garbage out the night before it was supposed to be picked up. The night before. Other times his wife would pick it up in the morning. Still other occasions their cat would wander. One thing's for certain, but we don't know what that is. I decided to ask the victim for her story. Mrs. Fisman? Jennifer? Were you afraid for your life? Um, when? Mrs. Fisman didn't have the answers we were looking for. How could she? She was dead. I decided to ask the killer himself, straight up. Mr. Fisman? Randy. Did you murder your wife? No. No! Oh, come on! There's no body, but there could be. Somewhere. Later. Bizarrely, police have found no evidence that any crime has occurred at all. I had a few questions for Sheriff Jim Dipstick. <laughs> Sheriff? Yeah. Are you a hero? Shoot, I ain't no hero. I was just a man arresting all of me a mad dog killer to justice. Save a couple food lives in the bargain, so if that's a hero, well then yeah, give me a medal. Oh, it's a cash. A lot of cash. Oh, and a sexy, beautiful woman. Make that Was it a case of he said, she said? Or was it a case of he said, she dead? <laughs> we'll be back with more shocking revelations, puzzling half-truths, and a chance to win up to $100,000 in cash after the break. Cookie? Thanks, Cliff. You've made me wet all over. When we come back, what about the children? And who are you to judge me? More of that in my salacious interview with dreamy young thug rapper Y.T. White, right after my Botox injection. <laughs> 